no swear, they 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 no Hey, yo, welcome back to another video. It's your boy EJ. I just want to tell everybody thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking the page. Bro, this page is growing out of control. I never expected this. All I did was get up every day, put it in the work, and then, you know, the rest is, uh, the rest is news, right? You guys actually seeing what's going on. Um, I did get into a, a couple wrecks here recently, man. I got rear-ended, then I got cut off by an 18-wheeler truck and towed to my Honda. And uh, right now I'm sliding and sliding in the car right now, man. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen as far as with those those cases. I don't know what's gonna happen, uh, but I know blessings are on the way. Um, blessings are on the way. So I started this video because today I gotta clean my driveway. It's hard to do with this brush. Um, so today I gotta go get dog food. As y'all know, uh, last week. It ain't been a week yet. Last weekend, I bought three or four bags of dog food, 44 pound bags of dog food, and I'm out already. Um, had a lot of people come in. That dog food killed my dog. That dog food bad and all that type of stuff, man. Listen, I don't know what the hell y'all talking about. But I've been using this dog food for a long time. Off and on, I switched up dog food a lot because she we gotta see what's working. And I was just feeding my dogs um, Diamond, Diamond Puppy. And all of them had runny shit and blood in their stool and all type of shit. So, and I've been feeding my dogs this other dog food, what's it called? Sport Mix. And y'all get on my shit. Talking about this, this, and that. Bro, this shit say 24% protein, 20% fat, balance ratio omega-6, omega-3 fatty acids, 100% guaranteed for taste and nutrition, and they weigh 44 pounds, okay? Made in the USA, all right? So y'all talk all your shit about that, uh, look at that. They eat ground beef, they eat chi uh, raw chicken, they eat liver, they eat a lot of shit, and they eat rice. You know what I'm saying? I feed them rice. So, do what works for you. Um, but the opinions and all that type of shit, you can leave that, keep that to yourself, man. Because I, I do what's for, I do what's best for me. And when I want to switch my dog to something else, then I do it, okay? My dog's fed, and it's good. It's all that matter. All right, check this out. So yeah, I'm sliding in the, uh, the Hemi today, man. I look for donuts in the car. I'm gonna give it to my neighbors. Know they're gonna be good too. They look cold too. Talking about, oh, they probably you don't know. Oh, no, they're not, nigga. You can finish. I'm just letting you pop. I'm gonna leave them right there. They're gonna come to the door. They're gonna go out. But yeah, so we're gonna slide, get some dog food. Sliding in the charger. It's gonna be one every day. I got a donut right there, man. No problem. Yeah, check out the charger though. You know what I'm saying? Got the car seats, the screen, you know. We finna slide though, you feel me? No, it's not my car. If you ask, it's a rental car. I got changed oil soon. The reason 
I got this is because, uh, you know, when the, my money come and all that type of stuff, I might end up, I might end up getting me one of these, so I just want to experience it. You know what I'm saying? Experience it again. But yeah. Oh, yeah. So I started this video to let y'all know. Two of Chloe and Zeus Productions have got puppies on the ground. One of them had a 10 piece, and one of them had a 17 piece. Although these puppies are not a year, one of them was an accident. The 10 piece was an accident. He called me, let me know it was an accident. He got 10 healthy puppies on the ground. The one that had 17 puppies, it was not an accident. She said her first heat came in four months. And sometimes dogs, sometimes they happen. You know what I'm saying? I make sure I'm still recording. All right, sometimes they happen where the dog might just come in heat at four, you know what I'm saying, early. So she ended up having her second heat a couple months ago and she's not a year. So they, you know, it's on it's on you to do what you, you know what I'm saying? Whatever you do as far as breed. Me personally, I'm not breeding a dog under a year. Um, I don't care if it has one, two, three heats, but that's just me. I think everybody should do whatever they need to do for them, for themselves and their own business and their family. When I say you're a dog, I'm not here to dictate what you do with it. That's not my job. And I'm never gonna take on that road to tell you what you should or what you shouldn't do. I think everybody gotta figure stuff out for themselves. Um, so yeah, so yeah. The girl, um, Tesla, I know y'all probably remember Tesla. She was gonna be my keeper. She was my keeper female. And it's crazy that my keeper female just dropped 17 puppies. Yeah. Chloe daughter, Zeus daughter, just dropped a 17 pup litter. Now all of them didn't survive, so I'm gonna put that out there, but guess how many survived? 12. That girl got 12 puppies. Tesla just had 17 puppies, 14 hour labor. 12 of them healthy, five of them gone. When I tell y'all my productions speak for themselves, they speak volumes. You know what I'm saying? When I got Chloe, Chloe came from a 10 pub litter. Chloe produced two 10 pub litters. I know what the hell I'm doing. I'm not buying dogs that have four puppies. I'm not buying dogs. I, if somebody, if I see a hard ass dog, on, and this have happened so many times, y'all. Not, I can't even count how many times this have occurred. Well, put my seatbelt on. I can't tell you how many times this has happened. Where like, I've seen a hard dog, but then I find out the mother only had two puppies. Well, I find out the mother only had three puppies. And I pass on it, you know what I'm saying? I pass on it. Cause like I said, I've studied genetics and I've studied pedigree. We looking for big little pups, you know what I'm saying? Pups from big litters. And what you got when you buy from me, you buy pups from big litters. We talking about 10 plus. The minimum I've had is nine. That's minimum. And and, and, and that's just nine survived. Cause Roxy had 14. Yeah, Roxy had 14 pups, nine of them survived. So you gotta know what's going on, man. Um, my production speak volumes. And right now I got two blue females and a blue male available. And that's from Chloe. So uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep a female. I'm gonna keep a female from Chloe this time. Um, I know I sold her whole first litter. And um, so right now, it's only one female and one male available from that litter. And I'm telling you, they throw numbers. You gotta know what's going on. Chloe blood throw numbers. Zeus blood throw numbers. Everything I got throw numbers. So without, the reason I, I've been kind of going back and forth on if I wanted to keep, um, one of the blues is because I got Nyla's daughter. You know what I'm saying? Nyla and Zeus' daughter. And she's gonna be a way bigger female than the blues. But the blues gonna be a way thicker, bigger bones than uh than Nyla and Zeus what I'm thinking. I'm thinking the bones and the structure on the blue is just gonna be yeah. But y'all know lilac -like and blue is the same damn thing. You know what I'm saying? So me having that lilac -like tri female, you know, ghost tri, whatever female from um, Nyla and Zeus, um, I feel like keeping a blue is literally gonna throw me the same thing. 
But with that being said is, I'm not just trying to have one litter a year. So um, I might be keeping them blue. I might be keeping them blue. Uh, might be keeping them blue. As far as dogs I got, sorry. As far as dogs I got available, Um, as far as dogs I got available, Cryptic Merle is sold. So if you're interested in Cryptic, it's too late. She sold over the weekend. You snooze, you lose. The person I sold it to don't want to be on camera. He's not trying to do YouTube thing. He just want to do low, be low key with his girl. He's not even gonna breed her. He's not. He's not breeding her. He's gonna fix. He just wanted a beautiful dog from Navy, and he got her. Okay. And it was it's kind of local too. So um, shout out to him, man. Shout out to Bro. Um, uh, Cop and Cryptic, man. So I do not have anything available left from um, Roxy and uh, Navy. Only thing left is Junior. And y'all know I'm not letting Junior go for no amount of money. Um, Junior is going to be one of my studs. And uh, that's what's going on. Alright, so my brother TJ. In other news, my brother TJ. This is just an update video, bro. It's a lot been going on. Shout out my brother TJ, man. Shout out my brother TJ, man. Shout out my brother TJ, man. I love you, brother. My brother, uh, the one that got Cheetah Girl. First pick female. Um, as y'all know, his female, because he locked in on a female from uh, from that litter. And uh, she ended up dying after like a day. Um, that's what I was saying. She just wasn't healthy. So what I did is, the best female from that litter, I gave him the best female from that litter. Because he trusted me, he locked in, he sent all the money up front. And he locked in on her. So I gave him the best female from that litter. My best female from that litter is in Florida with my brother TJ, man. Make sure y'all go follow him on Instagram. You know what I'm saying? He's doing his shit right now. I'm going to put his Instagram in the description. He got my best female. So what he do? My brother said, I'm doubling it back. And I want one of your males from Zeus and Nyla. I said, ooh. Ooh, he trying to do what I'm trying to do. You know what I'm saying? He trying to pull on me. He trying to, um, cause you know, I'm taking Junior to Hazel. And he just reversing it. But he reversing it better because he got a full Merle. I don't, I don't, the only Merle I got is, is Roxy. And she not going to be as close for size, health, as Cheetah Girl. He got the best female. So he wanted, he using not Zeus' son. He already bought her, y'all. He already sent me the money. He already bought Zeus' son. Cashed out twenty five hundred. Boom. He cashed out on him. Today he said, I, I don't know if I want Prince or Leo. So today he gonna pick Prince or Leo, and then I let y'all know there's only one male available from that litter. After that, after he picks, after he picks uh, Prince or Leo, there's only one available. And I'm sure he probably gonna go with Prince. So it's only gonna be Leo available. I might keep Leo around me, man. I might keep Leo around me. So I'm probably gonna send him Prince, more of a chill dog, but the same size. He's just a little bit more chill. And um, so he finna hit uh, Cheetah Girl with Prince. Come on, man, y'all got to know what's going on. And this is what I'm telling y'all, man. When, when somebody see a vision, somebody believe in a vision, and they see that shit coming together, bro, a lot of people don't hesitate. People that hesitate just you watch us. And ain't nothing wrong, because I tell you, even if you just watch and support me, I, I I love you for that. I appreciate you for that. But shout out my brother, man. My brother now owns two of my productions. And it's like, it's, I don't know, it's like three or four people that own two of my productions. And it's just, it's mind blowing that somebody spent much that much money with me and they came back because they didn't feel cheated. They didn't feel like I hit them over the head with the price. I hit them over the head with some BS production. I know I, I'm giving the best of the best. I'm putting the best dogs together and I'm creating better dogs. All right, I created a better Roxy. You know what I'm saying? I created a better Roxy with Cheetah Girl. You gotta know what's going on, man. I created a better Roxy with Cheetah Girl. Man. Matter of fact, this is a business call. So I'm gonna catch you guys later. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Hello?